This makes sense. I agree with this. What say y'all? Okay. What say y'all? A government official, a government official in Georgia government told me the migrants qualify for aid like food, clothing, and shelter merely because they have a nationality. They're not stateless beings. They're not colors. I agree with this. On some level, this is true. But it's not for me to try to convince you, you guys. That's not my place. I agree with this. On some forms of, of, of government, I agree with this. Now, what say y'all? Now, what say y'all? Because if they already, if they're nationals, if they're foreign nationals, yes, open up the floodgates. This is why they're able to have jobs, work in city and state positions without having to go through all the rigmarole like regular people. Now it kind of makes sense. Now it kind of makes sense. You guys are like, well, they don't have a, they don't have this. And they don't have that. They're foreign nationals. Some of this stuff doesn't apply to them. There's a, there's a, some in, Sa in Sacramento, a, a migrant given a position in, in city council, city council, a migrant. Okay. Now, does it make sense now? Does it, does, are the kind of the pieces, the blanks are being filled for some of y'all? Once again, I totally agree with this. I totally agree with this. We're talking government and law and color of law. This, this, this is, makes total sense. I agree. Okay. I'm just... Once again, I'm not here to convince anybody. I'm just for you ask me. Yeah, this makes sense. Complete, complete sense. You ever notice any, anybody that goes to the UN for help, they get help. There's one group of people that have gone to the UN numerous times and have not received help. Guess who those people are? Give me the one. I don't know. Give me the one race of people, the one nationality of people that have constantly gone to the UN for help over the last 50 to 60 years and have yet to receive aid or help from the UN. Who are those people? Oh. Who are the people that constantly <laughs> get rejected and denied help from the UN? That's right. Black people. That's right. Black people. Black people do not get help from the UN because there's no such thing as black people in law, on the books, on the record. That's why it was so important to, to convince y'all to keep changing to these terms they kept giving y'all. This makes total sense. Okay. There's not been one group of people that have never not gone to the UN and not gotten some type of help, aid, or acknowledgement. Okay? Even though, you know, Israel is kicking Palestine's ass, Palestine still be like, hey, do something. And the UN, you know, you know, takes their case and, you know, whatever the case may be. But black people, every time they go to the UN, nothing happens. Nothing. Okay. Yes, I know. But we now we not we now call them urban. But yes. All right. So just something for y'all to think about. Okay.